Hi, I'm Chris at Extractor Fan World, and this is the Solar and Palau Silent 100. It's a four inch axial fan designed for wall or ceiling mounting in shower rooms, bathrooms, and WCs, that sort of thing. We highly recommend it. Here's why it's the most powerful four inch axial fan available, extracting 95 cubic meters per hour. Thanks to a single phase class B motor, which is mounted on silent elastic blocks helping to prevent vibrations through the casing. It's efficient and quiet, and at full power, the motor only draws eight watts, and even when installed and working against resistance, the fan runs at only 25.6 decibels. It features sealed for life ball bearings, and as such comes with a five year manufacturer's warranty. Because both the motor and the bearings are sealed, it's IPX5 rated, so it can be mounted in any bathroom zone, as long as the circuit is wired into is RCD protected. If we look at the back of the fan, it has a built-in backdraft membrane which prevents cold air from entering the building when the fan's not in use. If we turn it around again and look under the fascia, 11 forward curved impellers machined very close to the rigid spigot housing force air through the guide vanes, very similar to a mixed flow or centrifugal fan. This results in excellent extraction pressure and a lot of push allowing it to be ducted further than any other 4 inch axial fan which we'll take a look at now. So to demonstrate the solar impellers superior air pressure out the back, we've lined it up against a pretty standard 85 cubic metre standard uh, bathroom fan, again 4 inch axial, but it doesn't have the, uh, the curved impellers that the solar and Palau does. So what we've got is a rather awkward 3 metre duct run attached to this vertical metre, and in here we've got a little puck that, uh, that measures the airflow coming through the duct. So what we'll do is turn on the normal one, much noisier fan to begin with. So we'll just attach that to the end of the duct. Let's see what happens. Nice and securely on there. Nothing happening at all. So if we turn that off and attach it to the S&P fan, the Simon 100, and turn it on. You can see the air pressure is significantly higher up that and most normal fans wouldn't be able to duct that far or with an awkward kink like that or that vertical. So there you have it. Silent 100 comes in four models. The standard model, which would usually be wired into a lighting circuit or on a separate remote switch. Flick the switch and the fan comes on, turn it off and the fan stops. Then there's the timed model, which runs for between 1 and 30 minutes after the lights have been turned off and the overrun can be set on installation. The humidistat model kicks in when the humidity in the room reaches a predefined level between 60 and 90 percent, which again is set on installation and switches off once the humidity has been cleared. This model is quite useful for bathrooms with a lot of natural light, where for example you might not turn on the light when using a bath or shower during the day. Finally there's the PIR or occupancy sensor model that switches the fan on when someone within four meters of the, of the fan is moving in the room and then turns off once they've left. When ordering, don't forget your ducting, your clamps and your grills, all of which we keep in stock and if you order them before 4pm you'll get them next working day. Links to all these products will be in the description below and if you have any questions or concerns just give us a call. Cheers.